Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Fearsome Fire, and I am back with another Super Mario Odyssey challenge video. And this is probably like my, I think this is like my 6th or 7th challenge video, but this one, as you guys remember, this one was actually recommend, recommended by one of you guys. As you remember in the last video, I said, hey guys, recommend me something, whichever one has the most likes, that's what I'm gonna do. So this one was actually recommended by Super Swag Guy on YouTube, and he said, there's a mini section in the Lost Kingdom where you use the Tropical Wiggler to press the P switches to lower um, bubbles of poison. Do it wiggle wigglerless. So that's basically this section right here. I have to do it without using any of these wigglers and just try to do it like blind basically. I haven't even looked at this one. I haven't done much at all yet. But the goal is just to do it without the wiggler. So I think I'm going to try to jump around. That's the best way to do it. And just try to avoid these big bubbles of, po of poison as much as possible. And at any chance I can, just basically jump over everything, get a vantage point, just get higher. Um, let me see. So over here, I think I need to p press the P-switch. He didn't say anything against pressing the P-switch, so I think I have to. So, yeah, let me just press these. And... Come on. Oh my gosh, wow, we were right at the end, though. So that was pretty close. So this might not be this might not be too challenging actually. Um, hopefully, hopefully I don't jinx my I don't jinx myself and doesn't come really hard to try to do that again. Um, yeah, just all right. So that time I jumped over. I know the first time I just went around. Um, let's see. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna go this way. Just try to get on top again. It's really awkward getting on top of this platform right here. This like high up platform, just because it's so skinny. It's just weird. And yeah, that guy's useless, that prana plant it doesn't really do anything. I can just skip over most of this stuff. So yeah, the first part's easy. It's this part right here that seems to be like the hard part. Just because these platforms are so small. And yep, look at that right there. I should have threw my cap. That was my mistake. Alright, here we go. Nope. And yikes. Alright, let me go over. That might have been too. Yeah. And I died. It's fine though, it's fine, it's fine. We still have another chance to do this. Well, we have plenty of chances, we have unlimited chances really. I, I'm honestly just rushing through it because it, I feel like I feel like it seems easier than it actually is, at least for me. I'm, I'm underestimating it really hard. But yeah, I'm just gonna get through this part again, the exact same stuff, get on top of here. I think you could do it without getting on top of that spot right there, but I would prefer to go on it if I if I can, you know? By the way, guys, make sure to check out my live streams. I've been live streaming a little bit lately, and it's been pretty awesome. It's been really awesome to talk to you guys, um, everybody that's joined my stream. So please make sure to check that out. And just like that, we did it. Boom. So that was the challenge. Uh, it was actually pretty simple. It wasn't that bad. It's honestly, I thought it would be worse when I first looked at it, but that was not that bad. So thank you, Super Swag Guy, for the challenge idea. And that's it, but actually... Alright guys, I am back, and I decided that I didn't want to cut the video short right there, so I came up with another little challenge that I decided to do. It's kind of similar to the last one, because it, it's the same premise, getting something without using the wiggler, but this one I think is going to be even harder than what I just did. And basically right over here, I need to grab this key, the key that's right there, and grab it without using the wiggler, and then going back and basically getting the moon. And I think that I've seen this been I think I've seen this done before. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure it is possible, but it's just like barely possible. It's another one of those like just barely possible jumps. So, I'm going to attempt it. I don't know how long this is going to take me, but this is probably going to be much more challenging than what I just did. So, yeah, here we go. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Alright guys, so first I'm just going to long jump, and that did not work, but I tried to get there. Okay, so now I'm going to try to go to the very edge, and no, I threw my cap at the wall, okay. I keep getting scared that like I'm going to bump into the wall though, because it's like, it's so, it's so small, like you, it's so short, and there's not enough room for Mario to really go in there normally. But I'm just going to try to do the same thing, but throw my cap forward, and nope, the exact same thing happened.
Okay guys, so it's been a lot later, so I'm just gonna make this update right now. Um, I finally know how to do it properly, you do need to long jump and then throw your cap backwards. But, yeah, you, you just, it's just all about timing really, and it's really hard to get the timing down. Okay, I got the key. Come on. Yes! Yes! Guys, I did it! Oh my gosh, I didn't think I was gonna get that. I actually did. Wow, I did it. GG. Twist and turn up treasure. Wow, guys. Oh my gosh, I'm amazed. I... That took me so long. I... Okay, and I just freaking killed myself. Yes, I did it though. Okay, I'm really happy. I'm... Oh, that's so awesome. Okay. Finally. Finally. So that wraps it up for that video. Thank you guys so much for watching this Super Mario Odyssey Challenge video. If you guys liked this one, then make sure to like it. Remember to, sub to subscribe. And like always, please leave su suggestions in the comments below for future challenge videos, future myth videos, any type of video ideas. I love hearing. I look through all of them. And I always try to take you your suggestions into account. It really is what I, I enjoy doing most when it comes to YouTube, is just looking at the comments. And I read almost every single comment in all of the videos. Even if I don't reply, guys, because I don't reply to a lot of them, I usually, I'm almost always responding. So don't let that stop you from replying. But like I said, thank you so much. Please remember to subscribe. And as always, have a great day, guys. Later.